Hello and welcome back to the Cinder Notes. Uh, I just got chased by a guard and I had to hide in this dank corner. I would love to mantle up there, but this little overhang is going to make that impossible. So they don't normally come in here, right? They were... Going. Alright. That was close. Could have been uh, disastrous, but... Luckily it wasn't. Maybe we say that. Okay, so... Anybody dropped anything of interest in this water here? Probably not. <laughs> See, these kind of little details is... I kind of get stuck on the... <laughs> kind of half got stuck under there. Uh, they look great. But um, it's the kind of thing where I wish Stark Engine had clip brushes. Because if you just, like, play a clip... Under that overhang, it'd be perfectly fine for the mantling, it'd be no problem whatsoever. But as the only physics, the physics representation of the level is the same as the brush representation, it uh, means you kind of have problems. If you go too much detail in your in your too much world detail makes for movement problems, which is not really an ideal trade-off. Right, step on it. Arrow. Oh, there's nothing on the shelf anyway. Fine. So this doesn't feel like it could be flooded, right? Oh, more healing. That's way up, perhaps. <laughs> well, this is the way I came in when I came running wildly down the stairs. Well, let's try this way. I have no idea where it leads. Seems more interesting. Although, hang on. I'm not, I don't have a key. Colin's keys are going to work. Yeah. I don't have a key for it. I can't stick a rope in there, so it does not feel like I can make progress there. Back to the stairs. What is it? it sounds like a much, much bigger door. That's the. Those sounds. We're just going to look for you in the basement.
of some kind of code locked door. I wonder if that's where the cinder notes happen to be. I see you up there. Oh, was I mantling onto a candlestick? It's a little ridiculous, new mantle. Who's, who's opening and closing that door that I'm hearing all the time? Nothing. Two, five, eight, you know, all these bookshelves are numbered. That's suspicious. Oh, it's gonna mean something. Ah, there's the front doors of the seminary. Wait, there is a guard up there, that's right, in the upper floor that we have uh, encountered and ran away from in terror. There is a way down to some hello old bricked up passageways. This place is a warren. I don't mean of the spectre variety. Yes, there's a ghost that haunts the rabbit tunnels. War Inspector. There's another way up there. Ah, uh, that sounds like somebody has some functional mechanist. Um, pottery. Okay, this probably opens, right? Maybe not from this side. Yep. What what is that thing doing outside Soul Forge? I do not like it. I cannot do anything about it. Just yet. I could go through that go that way, but that leads me to a new area I haven't explored yet, right? <laughs> I'm getting that lost. Regardless, I should probably try and be methodical. Hello? I caught a glimpse. Only a small coin, but that's something. What's that noise for? Well, I can't get up there. There's gotta be a stairway somewhere. Well, I guess I'm going back to those tunnels because I don't have any other way forward, right? I could go back outside and up to the roof, but uh, to this side. Nice indeed. Eight, five, two. Wait, 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 wait. I've been here. It's not a way forward at all. 
just the opposite. It's just a matching room, okay. I get the right stairs, I should take the stairs up. What? How the fuck did you see me? He was the guy opening and closing the loud door. That I was hearing before. Right, well it sounds like he's uh... Back to his patrol. It's not mean I'm safe because, of course, his patrol he was on his patrol when he saw me. Through a door, I think. It's like there's darkness here, but if I back up, it's not dark. Yeah, I think he saw me through that door in the distance. Patch of darkness is, is an anomaly. Oh. Wow, he even thought a glimpse of me out of the corner of his eyes. I was dashing up through this extremely bright light right here, which I'm not quite sure why it is so bright. I suppose it's supposed to be a light that's turned on, but isn't it? Oh, well, that one there. That's why it's so bright. All right. Let's keep let's keep this clean. Let's not let's avoid any bloodshed, especially my blood. And uh, let's put him in the basement with his friend. <coughs> his twin. So this is this is the top floor of the place. Let's not go there just yet. So okay, so this is the inventor's workshop that I was at before. Which is where he found us before, okay. So one of these rooms is private quarters of Carlin. Oh, I have been here before. Hang on, what? God, don't come in here, dude. <laughs> I mean, he's got no reason to come in here. I suppose if he does come in here, we've got a flash bomb. Okay, he doesn't come in here. Oh, somebody dropped a purse. Broadhead. A book that cannot be read. Shelf number one. I feel like for sure there's something up with these shelves. No, the place isn't haunted. No, Darth Wild doesn't plot anything against us. No, the machines aren't trying to kidnap you. 
No, Lord Carlin isn't a madman trying to sacrifice his soul to some pagan deity. Stop listening to Jonas. If you're such a scary chat, at least patrol in the courtyards. Just quit whining and do your bloody job. Consider this a warning. Next time, I'll tell Lord Carlin about all this nonsense. Yes. <sighs> what if Lord Carlin really is... Trying to sacrifice you all to some pagan card. Good. Hopefully be safe here, but one never knows. Oh, she just comes part way down the hall. So, as I said, I think I've been in this room, and is that when I was being chased by him? Yeah. You're right. I'm sorry. <sighs> you can sleep there. All right. Well, as Exciting as it is, I wonder if that's Carl in the private room. He's an important person, right? What? What is this? It looks like a weird metal pencil jar. Why is that valuable? I don't know. Or because it's inventory stuff, right? I mean, it goes in my inventory. Of my inventory, of course, it's inventory stuff. Uh, it's like a, a frog valve or something. The drains are clogged again. The basement is completely flooded. Thankfully, the water didn't rise too high this time. The generator keeps running. But I doubt it would last several days like that. It looks like a single drop of water could kill it at any moment. The way they've built it baffles me. No wonder they abandoned the place. I'm tired of David and his incompetence, and the public works can't help us anymore. Find a solution with the mechanists. I have to leave Dave at dawn and can't handle it myself. Alright, well that's a clue to me that uh, I can... Oh... I mean, I know I can turn off the thing, but it's like I was just thinking, why would I want to? I think I have an answer for that too. Okay, these little edges on the stairs are letting me have a silent way down without clattering all the time. So, like. Does that turn all the. Where did you come from? What? You just spawned. That's... my liking. Look, you can join your other twin friends here. They say it turns the lights off, but does, how, is it, how, how come all the lights are still on when the generator's off? What? 
feels brighter than it was before. That makes no sense. You turn the power off because it's darker, not brighter. That probably means this isn't going to work either, right? It probably needs power. The, mecha the mechanist bot is still in there. Alright, so that seems like it was a bad idea. Yeah, the lights are off. I mean, it's still... Still... Just, I don't get it. Why are, why are more lights on than they were before? But just different ones. I hate this place. Yeah, you and me. They can mock me all they want, but they have it easy at the station. They aren't patrolling those cold, dark corridors while dealing with these mechanist beasts walking around. And the noise they make is bone-chilling. I don't know how Marco can handle it. I swear I keep seeing things in the corner of my eyes. Or maybe I'm losing my mind in here. There must be a reason why this building was abandoned in the first place. And the north wing that remains sealed for no apparent reason? This place is cursed. I can feel it in my guts. Oh, that's why all the walls are bricked up. Why does this weasel that to us sleep at the inn and not in here with us? I guess he knows something we don't. It's not fair. Apple? Any any good wine? Well, I'll take a vase. Not a hundred percent sure if I'm seeing repeat repeated numbers on these shelves, but uh, it's possible. Hello. Who walks away from the game of cards leaving their money on the table? I mean, everybody in this universe, they're very trusting. And it's adorable and I love them for it. But they really should learn better. It's always someone like me who's just going to walk in and take all their money. So then where would they be? North Wing. Sealed. Maybe it's sealed because it's off the map, or maybe it's sealed because it hides a terrible secret. Let's try this key that we've got. So I realized what the mine could be useful for. Which would be the uh, mechanist beast. Instructions for the code. Datwa! We had to install a locking mechanism to access the library as someone tried to break in recently. Besides, I've had confirmation someone else is looking for the same thing we are. I cannot write the code as it, as it is deemed too risky by Giovanna. But I made sure it is related to the seminary somehow, so you can find it yourself. I'm sure you remember the old bookshelves with Roman numbers we found in the basement. I put them around the place, and if you follow the order on the next page, it will give you the code. Second floor, all right, northeast refectory. Second floor, southwest bedroom. Second floor, southeast quarters. Eastern shelves. First floor, southwest study, northern shelves. Needless to say, once you've figured it out, I'll ask you to destroy this letter. And don't tell the guards, I don't trust most of them. This will be useful. You're not wrong. It's a very nice piece of furniture there. Very nice valuable masks. We got here. The Pyrus. Lord Carlin, I made an appointment with Father Donovan and his engineers regarding our issues with the generator. I will have a word with them about the malfunctioning bolts as well. And I've given Marco your orders about that one. In the meantime, I've managed to set up a secondary access to the library in case the power goes out while I'm gone. I've connected the mechanism to the gate in the maintenance tunnel. If the turbine stops working, it releases the lock and the maintenance gate automatically opens. I know this is far from ideal, but at least we can access the library if needed. Wait, so putting the generator out will have... Uh... Tells me that putting the generator out will have disabled the access. I don't know. Let's let's check out the code anyway. What's there's instructions for the code we have? Second floor, northeast refectory, southwest bedroom. So northeast is here. Eight. Oh, I don't have any map pages, so I can't even check notes. So eight. Southwest bedroom. One. Southeast quarters, eastern shells. Eight one six. Oh, 
And then I don't know why I'm closing doors after myself. Uh, instructions for the code. Then, so it's 816, first floor, southwest study, northern shelves. Eight one six eight. I mean, I guess I could try it, right? But if the power's off, it's not going to work. Yes. Well, we'll have to use the maintenance tunnels then. Which, thankfully, we know how to get to. something else but it's just these different footstep sounds. Right, that is the door that won't open. So there's gotta be something about the Cinderos in here, right? Oh there's more of these things. And more tunnels. I guess that's where I'm going to have to go. I do like the way these the central area kind of seems to wrap around itself. Like the two sides always seem to have a room at a particular level, and the central area is somewhat disconnected. I knew where that, where that bot was. Wow, okay, this place goes deep. I mean, we're not in the north wing, are we? Yeah, I recognize this. Carlin's key doesn't open that, right? So that could be a way out. Mm, it seems unlikely that it would have been a way in, but maybe there's a key somewhere that we didn't find. Well, it looks like the north wing collapsed. What, what's going on here? Silver or something around. Very careless of them. So now I'm going to use my wood arrows. Probably okay to leave that one. Probably, he says. No guarantees here. Please don't come all this way. I 
And four worms, alright. Still got three left. I mean, there's still it's technically only two, but I wasted two. Alright. Still well spent. Oh, that looks like that's important. Also creepy. I'm going to waste. I'm going to waste two more water arrows. I don't know what's going to happen when I grab those cinder notes, and I do not trust this place. stuff happened here. What is up with this room? Well, let's make it all dark. Last what arrow? If there's another bot, I have a mind for it. I'm not expecting another bot. I don't know what I'm expecting, but... Oh, that's the one I should have done, huh? I'm definitely expecting something bad. I do love, I do love the, uh, the low arches here, the collapsed wall. Rusty shoot key. Loot. Ah, this is what I'm looking for. Send the notes. Well, I mean, that is what we came here for. Maybe... Maybe there's nothing bad to worry about? Can't have been that easy, can it? for the other shoe to drop. Maybe that's... Maybe that's it? <laughs> oh. That's a new guard. I think I'm going to go through the, uh, the inn. Alright, that's not here. So we have some amount of darkness here. Making way back to the warehouse. I've forgotten where the warehouse is. Oh, it's just around here to the left, isn't it?
Come on, step on the flash mine. Get back here, you coward! Well, I can step on it for you. Alright, I wondered if you had any loot. I should've looked, right? Should've looked. It was kinda pointless, but never mind. Where was the warehouse? Oh, it's right there. So, I guess... We're done. The appearance of one extra guard notwithstanding. <laughs> well, I suppose more than one because uh, I hear somebody else coming away to themselves. No idea where they are. So, job done. We got this in the notes. And now a quest to buy in the uh, Book of Ash can advance. We got almost all the loot, only 125 missing. Secrets found 0 out of 0. Would have been a very good mission to hide secrets in this. Um, it felt a lot more expensive than most of the other million units once I played. And I think this the this one and um, the one that had the, like the forest started off in the forest and had the temple and stuff like that. Both of these have felt big, and I think that's because they went long and narrow, so that you actually made progress through the mission. It's kind of there and back. Whereas some of the others that were more boxy, you just felt like you're just going around in a very narrow box. Anyway, that's uh, the Cinder Notes. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you here for the next mission.